Hey, what's going on, everyone? How you guys doing? My name is Matt Jarbo. Welcome back to Wheelman. Long time no talk because of a pandemic. Have not been able to go anywhere, do anything, things along those lines, and I've just been working my ass off. So today I decided, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to have a little bit of fun. I'm going to go to the Dollar Tree looking for Blu-rays. They don't got them, but I'm going to pick up some other stuff, and I'm going to do a Dollar Tree haul video because why not, right? Why not make fun of myself by buying things from the Dollar Tree and see what we can what we can get. So I bought a bag full of goodies. Literally, it was just like first thing I saw, going, 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 just grab whatever I could. So we're gonna we're gonna go through this together for this Dollar Tree haul video. So first things first, I bought this recorder for a dollar. I bought this recorder. I can't even open it. My God. Because for one, when I was a kid, I really liked these recorders, you know? When I was a kid, we had them in school, and I remember, like, learning how to play stuff. And I remember all that stuff, huh? Ah! There we go. Open it up. No returning this now. There we go. All right, how does it work? Okay, thumb over the thing. kind of cheap but it works i can uh, i can teach my children how to make uh music with this thing i guess if we cover it up all four and cover up that it's kind of crap it's cheapy but uh maybe i can learn how to play a song on this one maybe i can learn to play something good uh let's see here because I, i'm a hungry hungry boy got these uh tgi fridays uh, bacon and, and cheddar potato skins. I'm going to try one. Maybe we're not supposed to do that in these videos. I don't know. That's tasty. I like it. The very first mukbang video I've ever done. <laughs> Wash that down. All right. I picked up... <laughs> This, this is a, a dog, dog brush, but I'm using it for my cat, so I don't got no dogs, but I have a hairy ass cat. He might, um, he might like this. I got to clean him. It's the end of summer. He's, he's, uh, been shedding like crazy. So that's, that's good. Only a dollar on that one. Uh, let's see. I bought these, um, fake mustaches. I have a mustache, part of a goatee, but I thought it'd be kind of funny to get a fake mustache in case I need to commit any crimes. Uh, cause I could just get a fake mustache and then put one on like, let's see, like this one right here. We're just gonna, we're just gonna, how do you even open this thing? Right, right. Take it off. Okay. All right. Uh, I see a little kid up there. He's got it up. All right. We're gonna put it up like that. That's pretty good. This will go. I mean, it's, it's, it's a fuller mustache than what I have. And there's a bunch of different designs too, which I like. So, uh, that's pretty good. Uh, that can go along with this, uh, I, what is it? It's a just pretending dress up fun. It's a hair extension for four years and plus my daughters are two and they are one. So it's difficult to do this with them, but I thought this would be kind of interesting, uh, for me, if I'm going for like a Halloween look of, uh, a mustachioed, uh, long haired hippie type fella. So let's see what we're working with here. Okay, that goes on this way. Taking off the hat. All right. Just gonna, just gonna put this on. Just gonna. There we go. There we go. All right. He's got the ponytail. Got the year. All right. We got ourselves. Um. We got ourselves a good thing here. I think it's all right. I think it's okay. Uh, what else we got in here? Right. Right. Uh, because of the uh, recent passing of uh of Chadwick Bozeman. I thought it would be a good idea to get a uh a Black Panther mask. Uh let me see here how it, how it how it looks on me. I'm going to take off that. I don't know why there's this plastic tip on the top of it. Kind of destroys everything, but let's see. All right. There we go. There we go, folks. I think I'm looking real Wakanda like. I got my I got a full-on disguise. I could go I could go rob a bank right now. I'm not going to, obviously. I could go rob a bank. And then they're like, who is that guy? And I'll be like, ha, 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 ha. Ron Jeremy stash over my regular stash. My my fake hair. Uh, it's great. Now, the question then becomes, what would I use to rob 
the store with if I was going to. Well, they they this they really had a whole thing going on here because I want people to take me absolutely seriously when I do this. I want people to take me absolutely seriously. So I got this here fake cap gun. Ah! I'm here for all the money. Ah! Right? It's clearly not real, but it is definitely something. People out there might get a kick out of that. So there's that. I'm going to take off the mask and I'm going to take off the hat. And I'm going to put back on the glasses. And the, I think the stash is going to is gonna hurt. Ah! Ah! Ow! That actually kind of hurt. All right. What else did I get in here? So I bought a bunch of jokey stuff. Um, let's see. I got my daughter. Actually, this is for my daughter. My daughter is a really big Toy Story fan. So I got the, uh, the Bo Peep. Uh, it's, it's a dish rag. It's a wash rag, but it's like, it could help her, you know, when she's in the bath and stuff. Uh, so that could work out pretty well. She'll like that. I think quite a bit. Uh, let's see here. I got, what's this? Oh yeah. It's Halloween time. So I got these, uh, these skeleton, uh, these skeleton things, right? Uh, these skeleton tongs. Not that I'm necessarily the biggest, uh, the biggest Sally eater myself, but at the same time, these could also double as excellent ball scratchers. You know, for those when the, you're playing a video game or you're on the computer, it's a hard to reach moment and you got to get in there and you just got to scratch, scratch, scratch. That could be a thing. Um, I'll have to let you guys know how this works, but I'm probably just going to use them for salad and not for scratching my genitals. Uh, because I like to be caffeinated, I got a um, fruit punch. Rockstar. Those are actually pretty tasty. Uh, it's a mini one, so it's not a full can, so it's like an afternoon treat sort of thing. And all right, uh, coming into the final, the final two items here, uh, we got um, personal lube. I bought personal lube. Uh, it's intimacy is in the touch, is what it says. It's warming jelly. I've never actually used any of this before. I never have had the need to use this before, but it was a dollar and it's from Natureplex and you never know when you might need it, right? Let's see here. The use. Let's look at the use here. Well, directions. Let's look at the directions. Remove the cap and seal. Apply desired amount to intimate areas. Reapply as needed. Replace cap after use compatible with latex condoms only. I didn't buy any latex condoms unfortunately. Uh, but its use is it provides personal lubrication intended to enhance the ease and comfort of intimate sexual activity. Uh, again, not like I've never had a problem in that department. Uh, I just thought it would be funny to spend a dollar on lube, uh, because I was also looking for pool noodles and I, and, and I was going to make like a DIY fleshlight because I thought you could take a sock and shove it in there and a pool noodle and cut it off and cap it off and, and put the lube and you'd be good to go. Uh, that, but it's summertime's over now, so I can't go get the pool noodles. So there goes the DIY flashlight idea. I'm going to have to wait to do this again until next, until next summer. Uh, and then finally, cause I thought this was pretty funny. This is three years and up. My kid will get a kick out of this. This is poop. It's poo poop, right? Poodoo is what it is. Uh, stretch it, uh, whatever. It's not, What's it say? It's not gross at all. Let's find that out. All right. Obviously, you uh, you you want to have it here. Okay. This is a it's a it's a disc. What the hell is this? All right. We're just breaking the seal. Breaking the seal. What is this? All right. There's a ring. It's it, okay. It looks like a uh, you get this little cylinder thing. Although this could technically work as like an O-ring for the flashlight I was talking about earlier. So I'm gonna keep this in mind. Uh, all right. And then, oh, I see. It's a, oh, look at that. It's like, it's like chocolate pudding, man. It puts the poo inside the cup and then it gets in your hands. Not, oh my fuck. Okay. What was that? Is it like, oh shit. It dripped out. Okay. Ooh, I don't want to get that in my car, but it gets the poo and it, <laughs> it's disgusting. That is, that is absolutely that's absolutely disgusting is what that is, guys. Oh, and it's everywhere. I'm going to use this. I have a napkin in here. 
So anyway, that was my Dollar Tree haul. I just wanted to go and have a little bit of fun and, and see what I could find and then just make fun of. Uh, you know what? It was only like, I think like, I think I spent like 13 bucks for everything. So you know what? Maybe I'll do this once a month or something like that. Have a little bit of fun. And uh, let me know what you guys think about this down in the comment section. If you're new to the Wheel Man channel, please do me a favor and subscribe. I will be going to more places wherever it's open and I can get some, get some shots. But the Dollar Tree stuff is just too fun to pass up. All right, everyone. I'll talk to you later. Thank you again for watching. Have yourself a great day and peace out.